brand new today. We are fewer than two dozen. It is $1,000 off. It is a once in a lifetime moment. You're getting an 18 inch chain, but there is the ability to make it a little shorter at 16. It literally some, looks like something that came out of a like a silent movie star's collection of gems. And Peyton and I were waxing and poetic about all the gems we saw on the red carpet. Like it really was pink. a gem moment. It was a lot of beautiful pink. You love the pink. I love the you pink. You love the pink. I love the pink. So this is brand new. The free shipping and the price goes away at the end of the day. It is a $5,000 pendant because you're looking at three and a half carats of Brazilian pink tourmaline set in gold, accented by diamonds. Chain is included. And I mean, even just from the accents of stones you see at the top and the bottom and the like that mill grain look on the outside. Oh my goodness. So Peyton, you handpick every gem, every piece, every setting, every everything for us. And we do vault discoveries, I don't know, how many shows a year? Maybe five? Maybe. Brand new product, maybe two, maybe, maybe two. three. Because that's all we can get. Two or three shows a yeah. year. So let's discuss how this can enhance your gem collection. And obviously I'm in a pink mood tonight in my Susan Graver, <laughs> so yay. Beautiful. This is from the Mauro Rodondo mine, probably the most famous of all pink tourmaline mines. Some of the finest merchandise comes from that mine. And when you look at this color, number one, Color, 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 so deep. You know, if it, if it was on a lighter background, you would even get to see how much light, how the true color of it. But look at this true pink. The cutting here is amazing. It's an octagon, but it's a brilliant cut octagon, which is quite different. A lot of time when it's an octagon, it's a step cut, okay. which is beautiful. But this was such a fine stone. We went one beyond that. Our master cutter actually came up with a special cut to make it the most brilliant I've ever seen wow. of any tourmaline. And okay, when, when Peyton Kelly says that, this is the most brilliant that he's ever seen. You know, I, I've been, I know he's now retired, but I, we've been with the <laughs> curator of the National Gem Collection, Dr. Jeffrey Post, with Peyton. Peyton is honored everywhere you go with him. So for you to say this is the most brilliant you've seen is incredible. I just want to show you one more thing before we go over and, and lend this to Alex. No, just kidding, Alex. Um, this is something that you include because this is something that you do for all of the customers who love to shop for you. Can you explain what that's all right, about? Right, right. Inside, there's a little bit of information about what why we call it Vault Discoveries. And there's a picture of me, unfortunately, at the Imperial Topaz Stop. Mine. But on the back is where it's really important. There's a location there for you to go and print out the story that we're talking about. There's a picture of the item, there's a description of it, the QVC description, but then there's the stories that we're talking about, all right there. Please print it out. You won't see this pendant again. You won't see this kind of quality. You definitely won't see a three and a half carat stone of this kind of quality and this kind of color. And if you're in the mood for pink, and this is a little bit out of the price range right now, stay tuned for our one-time only value. I have a feeling it's already popular, but what are some of the reasons why you're drawn not just to tourmaline but the brazilian pink tourmaline well the brazilian pink tourmaline is such a unique pink it's a very deep pink you can't say it's a light pink because it's a very deep pink it's got that true pink color that when you think about deep pink that's what it is mm -hmm. but it's also it's completely clean there are no inclusions and when you see the cutting on this and you see the movement of this, and I'm, I'm looking forward to, to seeing it on her neck, because when you see it and you move just a little bit, I want you to see the fire and the life that's in that stone. It's absolutely incredible. And I love that Alex chose an outfit that is definitely, you know, how we're dressing right now, a cute jean jacket. Um, Alex also rocks my jean jacket. Alex, it's now half price, by the way, if you want to go shopping at QVC.com. <laughs> but, like, I love that you're wearing this pendant and it does not have to be something that's super dressed up. I will say we put it on Alex backwards. So um, yeah, there you go. Thanks, Alex. Okay. Putting on zero. I will not call out who it was. <laughs> You put it on backwards, dude. <laughs> you know what? But it was still beautiful. It was still you beautiful. You still saw that gorgeous it color. It was. And like, I, right? Yeah. Right? And Alex is wearing a beautiful, vibrant green. It still shows off that pink. And the other thing is, if Alex wanted to wear the pendant a little higher, um, 
that would be an option because this is an 18 inch chain, mm -hmm. but you have the ability to wear it at 16 inches and the chain is removable. So for if whatever reason right. you wanted to add your own chain with a more delicate bail, you could do that right, as well. Right. So there's no other Montana Sapphire in the show. There's no, no other Brazilian pink tourmaline in the show. Um, just a beauty. This is it, one of a kind. Oh, yeah. If you've ever won, I know if you have a beautiful pink tourmaline ring that's from Brazil, this is going to match that. It's gonna be that same deep, really rich pink that you see in your ring. So if you have the ring, please think about the pendant because it really is, it's a once in a lifetime. Yeah, it is. The, it's not just the color, it's the cutting. It's from the most important, rarest, really most historic mine right. there is for pink tourmaline. Right. And I mean, this is the kind of jewelry that you would see on Fifth Avenue. This is the kind of jewelry you would see at an auction house that some of our friends work for in New York City. Um, this is a beautiful piece. And you know what, I'll grab it and, and put it on for the rest of the show because it didn't sell out. But how many left? I know, I'm stealing a fact. Fewer than a dozen. Fewer than a dozen to go around. Okay, so Peyton,